and we're back already. This is the yeah, it's the same loading screen that I was on in the last video. I just stopped it and recorded right away. Hopefully these uh more and only because you want I'm gonna apply those later I think I can upgrade this quite a bit now but... I'm honored to see you Eivor Thor's testicles what is happening? <laughs> Thor's testicles Eivor? oh boy Swanborough I no gods no don't say it please Eivor don't say it <laughs> I am sorry. Oh! My own... No! My poor swan! Oh, uh, I will leave you to grieve. I know words are a poor solve for a wounded heart. I'll leave you tomorrow. I know that we are here for you. Always. Should you need us. She is widowed. Thor's testicles. What is happening over there? Uh, I do not care. For one. Oh, let me tie on this. Oop, I'm running into stuff. All right, got the stopwatch going. I want to say we're like two minutes off. Randy. Hey, my boy. Something for you. A message. Quite strange. Uh -oh. Good day. Hamptonshire has fallen and withered the kingdom of Wessex. But the course was great, maybe too great for all we gained. Rest then. You have earned it. On the backs of so many. Time will tell if it was worth it. That's a lot of things to update. Let me upgrade. Um, let's talk to this gentleman. Something for me. What is it? A letter requesting your presence in the southwest, a village called Athelny. Nothing strange about a summons for me, is there? It is not the recipient I find strange. It is the sender. The letter is signed a poor fellow soldier of Christ. Uh -oh. Ah, a mysterious partner. For a short time, I hoped it might be Bassam feeding us the names of these targets. He seemed the most likely man, for a time. Only one way to discover the truth. Thank you, Hytham. I'll take care of this. You guys gonna pause and read that? We're gonna go to another one of these random calls. I don't care about the opal, so I am not going to get them this time. I really don't care. I think I got the most powerful. Oh, I need, I can upgrade it, I think. Yes. Yeah. That's like the best weapon I have. You don't want to leave me there. I'm careful. Oh my god, I thought that was my horse. Where's my horse at? Come on. Hey, I stopped for a second and I said, yeah, there we go. My horse like, nope, that is not it. It's definitely not this place. Is it? No. No, that's 
last night, 900 meters away. This player over here in Tim Buck T. Like little settlement over here. Um, let's go this way. I am here, dear friend. All right there? Yes, <clears throat> hello. I do not mean to intrude, but I'm looking for someone. And who would that be then? I... I do not know exactly. Well, that'd be why you ain't found him. But you're free to pass the time just here if you like. Thank you. Take a nap by this lovely tree. And then die. Your soul cakes, love. Do you know soul cakes? I do, I enjoy them. They're small things, size of a lumpy fist, so they'll bake fast. Keep your eyes sharp. And the butter, do I baste them? No need, love. We leave the butter for meal time. I look forward to it. Right then. I'll leave you to this. If you need me, I'll be doing the washing up next door. What? Quite a step down from your former work, Lord. As their guest, I volunteer to help with the daily chores. They offer me a bed. I tend the cakes. Do they not feel strange giving orders to their king? Or do they know? That knowledge would benefit no one. I read your message. You went through a great deal of trouble to obscure yourself as this poor soldier of Christ. As I remember... You even sent yourself one of these letters in Winchester. A clever touch. The Order wanted me dead. I had to be careful. You said you knew nothing about the Order then. Pled ignorance. But you knew everything. Their names. Their schemes. Would you join me for a walk? Bro, what is going on? You look well, Eivor. I am. The wars have ended, and my settlement thrives. The wars have not ended. You have simply stopped fighting. But men are brewing plots in mead halls and bedrooms. You will see. Now are you, Alfred? Getting used to the idea of being unremarkable. I am well. Better than I expected. In this exile, I have found a somewhat nourishing peace. Each morning I am awakened by the sun and growling cormorants. I bathe in the chilly water of the marsh. I eat from shrubs and drink from buckets. It is a good life. Simple. Blessed. I've never been so far west. I find it quite peaceful here. Calming. I've traveled a long way to hear one name, Alfred. Who is the Order's Grand Magister? 
Tell your shadowy friends that England is swept clean. Your work is done. You. Grand Magister was not a title I desired. It passed to me on the death of my brother. From my father before him. Defilers of God's majesty and grandeur. I was their master, and I loathed them. With Goodwin, I set a plan in motion to destroy the Order from within. But my troubles with the Danes delayed that plan. But your trouble with this Dane is what led to their demise. You are Norse, are you not? You have a good ear. I owe you my thanks, Eivor. For that, I give you this. The key to my study. That you may better understand the good you have done. With the Order all but destroyed, you have made room for a greater idea. One to take its place. A universal, divine order. Inspired by God for the betterment of man. With a poor fellow soldier at its head. You have saved England. Whether or not that was your intent. Now let England save you. England is no more, Lord. You're the last of her kings. And yet, you have no kingdom. Look around you. God's works are wondrous. They cannot be ignored, nor resisted. In time, all those who accept God will flourish, and all those who defy him will fall away. Should you remain in England, you too will one day be her subject. Oh, bloody crumbs! The cakes are burned! Where is that man? The young man! Where have you gone? Damn. That may have earned me a night of washing linens. I do not know if we shall meet again, Eivor. God willing, we will. As one lord to another, perhaps. Mm, I'm coming, my lady. I'm here. I feel like he is... Dude, he's setting up something for him to do later. This is I. So he was the last one. I should assassinate him, right? What that about? Do I get the option? Alfred gave me a key to unlock his study. Somewhere in Winchester. Dear, oh dear. Look at them little balls of soot. Good lady, forgive me. I was lost in thought. No matter. Just let him cool and we'll begin again. Dire. suspicion about him this whole time and it was it was him and she three ways to read them you have it
I should not be seen in this area. Talk to hide them. I'm trying to, but they want to be faster. Oh, there we go. Jeez. I've been trying to fast travel for the fast for the past for the last four minutes, and they was like, no. Hey, that is so coy, uh, not coy. Um, is that the right word? Of the order. To do that, it's like, yeah, I'm the head dude, but you can have my coin. I don't want it. Like, like, yes, one more, and you know, only because you all have yeah, such good taste. Now, this, like, I gave the this game, one uh, begins a long, long time trick. ago at a desert oasis. Have you brought? Here you are, Hytham, the last of the Order's sigils. You'll find King Alfred's among them. King Alfred. Did our poor fellow soldier lead you to his hiding place? He did, but they were one and the same. Our poor fellow soldier of Christ was the Grand Magister of the Order of the Ancients. He turned on his own order. Fascinating. Not turned so much as trampled. His devotion to Christ and what he calls a universal order set him against them from the start. With all sincerity, he loathed the title and the duty he had inherited and wished them destroyed. Wonderful. With his abdication, the last stronghold of the Order has been dismantled. All that remain are scraps here and there. And you, Eivor. Now that you have seen our enemy and you understand our cause, I wonder if you would join us. Become a hidden one. Was this your ultimate goal, Hytham? A trial by fire? It is a kind offer, but I do not believe we fight for quite the same cause. Your creed demands that you keep your triumphs hidden. I prefer my glory to be in plain view for all to see. If I taught you our creed, if you spent time with it, it could open your mind to another view. Another view is always welcome. But to live without celebrating one's glory and honor and achievements is not a life for me. But know this. I would give my life in a moment for those I love and who love me in return. All here, including you, my friend. I understand you well, Eivor. Very well indeed. Indeed. Uh, Tanos... No, no, Tanosku? Yeah, Tanosku. Oh, now, what? this... This... No, brother, hush. Oh, let me go do this real quick. Stretch your wings, Sunan. That helps. This... This one begins... begins. Oh, yeah. 
never heard tell of any river champion. Not sure what to make of that. But you're welcome to ask Eivor. Suniva and stranger, what brings you to our shores? Vaughn and his crew claim to be raiders of great treasures. They seek to join with Ravenstock. If you wish to join us, we only ask for hard work and loyalty. No need of silver or gold. Wouldn't say no to it, either. It is good to meet you, Eivor. And there is more in this for you than precious metals. We may seem weary and ragged, but we know secret routes of England's coasts, where you will find a wealth of resources for Ravensthorpe. You seek to share them with us. Why? When the table is laden with too great a feast, you gather friends round to enjoy. We seek friends and feasting. Let me show you. I will take you out on a raid. Once we repair our ship. I appreciate the offer. And accept it. How do you judge our dock? Ah, now that's a dock worthy of our longship. Come and talk to me whenever you are ready to leave. Are you ready to set sail? Uh, oh, influence a part of I am ready. On to the raid. We will use my crew for the first outing. Easier for me to show you what lies along the river bank. Later, you are welcome to send your own Joms Vikinger along the paths we travel. Mine could use the rest. This river does not appear on any maps. Few know how to navigate it. Sail! The young Vikinga have been learning its spirits. An old friend said it was a smuggling route for Roman traders. She claimed it was useful in hiding their tracks. In fact, it is so well hidden. You could raid your very neighbors and they would never know it was you. Something to think about. Look! There! Villages! Not holders of wealth, mind you. Remember, trained wolves. We'll respond to your order.
returns of the ship. We are done here! Come on! I've had tougher fights in taverns. Well, stay alert. The smoke hey! from the flames will alert camps downriver. The fighting will get tougher as we go. Military camp. You will find foreign supplies and even gear. It will put up a fight. But so be it, yeah? We beat the Raven this day! Join the battle. Fighting your time for bigger fights. More of a captain. Run up the sail! Odd, isn't it? A raider who doesn't raid. Turns out, spending years getting damn near chopped in half leaves you with enough aches and stiff muscles to keep you all bound. Now come, let us go. Thanks, man. Always getting chopped in half. You see smoke? I don't see any smoke.
I don't know about you, but I am ready to return to Ravenstorm. Let the crew know when you are ready. That was invigorating, and as lucrative as I promised ya. Think we have got enough supplies here to put something together? Something like what? A place to stay where we can stretch out. Oh, wouldn't want to bother Adis and the rest. You know Adis? Uh, I... I know of Adis. Her reputation as a fighter and as a trainer precedes her. Simply wouldn't want to get in her way. I see. Well, we have space for a hall. And with enough supplies, we can make something in due time. since we've had a permanent place to gather and share stories. Come here to hire more Yom's Vikinger for your raids. With time, it will attract some impressive fighters. Real talents. That didn't move the needle at all. I'm on chapter one. I'm gonna take these out and see what those do. Next time, I'll do this one. But, but, um, let's go. When it's almost done. No, that's good. No, that's good. Thank you guys for watching. Comment, subscribe, drop a like on that, but no, drop a spirit bomb on that like button. Do that for me. But tell your mom, tell your dad, because I have to get in everyone. And remember, in the words of the great Lei Wu Long, you are not good enough. Dumb arigato gozaimasu. Jamata.